Have you ever wondered how you can tag X, Y, and Z coordinates inside of Recap 360? Uh, well, this is actually a really easy process. The first thing that you need to do is you need to make sure that your annotations are turned on. You can go here by toggle UI elements and making sure annotations is highlighted in blue and measure and notes are turned on. The second thing you need to do, which is really simple, which is adding a note. If I click on add notation and then click on note, I can hover over any point and it gives me the coordinates of that specific point. But the second that I maybe zoom in on a location and select a specific point that I'm looking for, I can name that point, name one, say OK. And what it will do is when I'm outside of the tool now and I hover over that point, it will give me the coordinates of that specific point, as you can see here. So as you can see, it's really simple, uh, easy process to follow inside of Recap 360. Now, it, what I've done here in this example is I wanted to tag all of the specific targets inside of this building. And it was really simple to just go through and tag the center of all of these different targets, notate them for whatever the target is, in this case 2-2, and now I know the coordinates of target 2-2. So if you're putting together repeatable volumes or other uh, applications where you'd want to know what exact target points you're using on a repeatable basis, and this is the process that I would suggest. Hopefully this helps you identify ways to use Recap360 to get more out of your scan data.